It's an expensive option, but for patients who need to get a world-class hospital, a state-of-the-art flying ambulance is now available round the clock. It's run by the same team of doctors who flew Nirbhay to Singapore and brought back VC Shukla, the senior Congress leader from Chhattisgarh, after he survived the attack by Naxals. India's first state-of-the-art air ambulance, Flying Doctors India. Tailor-made and equipped with the state-of-the-art intensive care unit on a dedicated chartered aircraft. The goal to provide critical care even when a patient is in transit. The air ambulance is being run by the same team of doctors who flew Nirbhaya to Singapore and brought back VC Shukla from Chhattisgarh. So what used to happen, we get a call, we call the, uh, the airline uh, or air charter service, we mm. tell them uh, we need to go so and so place, they'll rip out the seats because these are commercial planes they were. Mm. So you rip out the seats and you put some sort of makeshift uh, stretcher mm. arrangement and you fly out. Mm. We have converted a Jugar into a real mm. air ambulance which has all the facilities of intensive care. Now, response time being the most crucial. This particular aircraft can be ready to fly in a matter of 20 minutes, going to a maximum of 90. This is a leap forward. Earlier aircraft would take a preparation time only of about three hours. Another is that this particular machine can run at length, has an endurance level of 7.5 hours. This means it can run at length for 7.5 hours without requiring to refuel. What used to happen hmm. uh, when, with the, like I talked about the hmm. Jugar, hmm. that you'd pick up the patient on a stretcher hmm. from the ambulance, bring them in, try to get them in here. Hmm. So unnecessary movement and move, uh, you know, uh, transporting hmm. would, you can disconnect lines, you can do many th wrong things hmm. that can happen by this inefficiency. Hmm. So now with this, hmm. we park the ambulance right here, the stretcher goes up on this and it slides here. So this seamlessly, hmm. a patient can be transferred without any disconnecting lines or, you know, reconnecting them and losing lines on the way or... If you look at it, hmm. we feel that on an average, hmm two to three hours can be saved by this kind of inefficiency. It is still not cheap. Hiring an ambulance can cost at least 50,000 rupees per hour. But it could be the difference between life and death for patients who have no option. Flying doctors is expected to be a leap forward in catering to patients even in smaller cities. The air ambulance has rough field capability and can land even in unprepared airstrips. In New Delhi, Sonal Mehrotra for NDTV.